हेलो व्यूअर्स आई एम मिस्टर दिलीप कुमार पाल स्टेन बिफोर यू विथ टॉपिक रोल ऑफ मैरिज इन द लाइफ ऑफ वुमेन व्हाट रोल मैरिज प्लेस इन द लाइफ ऑफ वुमेन इट इज फाउंड इन प्लस थ्री फर्स्ट सेमिस्टर एथिक्स एंड वैल्यू पेपर एंड द नेम ऑफ द पेपर इज वुमेन social institutions and practices but before i start i want to inform my viewers that the name of my channel is at the rate dilip kumar pal 9375 never forget in this video you will find videos relating to plus 2 first year plus 2 second year videos relating to plus 3 first semester to sixth semester and some videos of plus 3 first semesters environmental science ethics and value political general elective some videos of ethics and values political science general elective plus the second semester and some videos of ethics and values of plus 3 third semester and i request my viewers to subscribe my channel if you are not subscribed and you are those of your friends who are in your classes about this channel so some students will be benefited let us start role of marriage in the life of women what role marriages play in the life of women no doubt both men and women marry but what is the role of marriage in the life of women let us start in the life of women marriage plays a very significant role marriages are life changing events for women due to marriage women have to change their living place their lifestyle they are expected to learn and perform a lot of new social duties as per hindu religious tradition men cannot perform many religious rites without marriage men alone cannot perform pancha mahajagya and he can perform it only with his wife but due to marriage women face a lot of problems in comparison to men mentioned below no doubt men as well as women marry it is a part of social tradition but marriage is play very important role in the life of a women because after marriage a women will have to change his living place he have to change his lifestyle and he will come to her husband's house where he she will perform a new type of duties a new type of functions and on the basis of hindu tradition after marriage only a man can perform some religious work without marriage a man cannot perform some religious work beside his except his wife for example pancha mahajagya a man can perform only along with his wife so marriage is very important for both men and women but marriage play important role in the life of women due to marriage a woman faces a lot of problems in comparison to men so what type of role marriage has in the life of a woman number 1 problems of problems for women of marriage due to marriage what problems a woman faces number 1 a vital problem marriage creates for women is that a woman is undervalued in marriage negotiation her competence capacity worth are never taken into consideration at the time of 
marriage negotiation. The first problem a woman faces immediately during marriage negotiation is that her worth, competence, value, capacity are not given much attention. So it is a type of insult to a woman because during marriage negotiations, before the marriage, when marriage negotiations will be made, the competence, value, worth of women is not given importance. It is a type of insult to a woman. Number two, another vital problem marriage creates for women is that men and his family have an upper hand in marriage. Their decisions mainly prevail over the decision of women and his family. Another insult to a woman due to marriage is that during the time of marriage negotiation or after marriage the man and his family members will play a major role in comparison to women and his family. So during a marriage negotiation and after marriage, a man and his family or a husband and his family members play an upper hand. Then a woman and his family members. It means a husband and his family members play a major role in comparison to women and his family members. Number three, another problem marriage creates in the life of women is that their consent and choice hardly play any role in a marriage. Another insult to a woman is that during marriage negotiation, a woman's consent and choice is not given importance. It is another type of insult to a woman because during marriage negotiation and after marriage also, a woman's choice and consent are not given any importance. Now, four, another problem marriage creates is that it always treats women as a subsidiary to men or serving as assistance to men. Another insult to a woman after marriage is that women is considered as a subsidiary to men or women is considered as an assistant to a man. It is another type of insult to a woman. Now five, another problem marriage creates is that during marriage negotiations, sometimes happy dowry is demanded before bride's family. Sometimes after marriage also dowry is demanded. If there is any hesitation in this context, torture both physical and mental are given to bride. Another problem marriage creates for women is that during marriage negotiations and after marriage also, dowry is demanded before the women and his family members. If there will be any hesitation in giving dowry, then there will be torture both mental and physical for women. Then six, it is another type of problem, an insult to a woman. Six, another problem of marriage is that after marriage, Women opt for culture of silence. She is unable to speak up against predatory behavior of men. Predatory behavior means exploitation, manipulation, harm to others for personal gain and or satisfaction. Another problem for women after marriage is that after marriage, a woman will have to perform culture of silence. After marriage, a woman will have to remain silence. 
टॉलरेट एवरीथिंग सी इज अनेबल टू स्पीक ऑफ एगेंस्ट प्रिडाटोरी बिहेवियर ऑफ मैन आफ्टर मैरिज वुमेन विल ऑलवेज रिमेन साइलेंट सी विल टॉलरेट एवरीथिंग इवन सी विल टॉलरेट द प्रिडाटोरी बिहेवियर ऑफ हिज हस्बेंड प्रिडाटोरी बिहेवियर मीन्स एक्सप्लोटेशन मेनिपुलेशन हार्म फॉर पर्सनल गेन इट मीन्स द वुमेन सो प्रिडाटोरी बिहेवियर मीन्स द हस्बेंड विल एक्सप्लोइट हर वाइफ सी विल मेनिपुलेट हर वाइफ सी विल हार्म हर वाइफ हिज वाइफ फॉर पर्सनल गेन That also a woman will have to tolerate. Six, seven. Another problem of marriage is that women face culture of violence by partner and his family members after marriage. A woman will have to tolerate all type of violence of it of her partner and her husband's family members. Eight. Another problem of marriage is that widow. Widows are inhumanly treated than widows after marriage. Again, after marriage, widows are inhumanly treated than widows. Nine. By marriage, sometimes women face martial rape. Means establishment of sexual relations against her wish. Another problem after marriage is that after marriage, women will have to face marit martial rape, marital rape. means the uh, husband of the woman will have to establish sexual relationship against her wish that also a woman will have to tolerate 10 early marriage creates problem for women physically and mentally if there will be early marriage it will harm the women physically and mentally 11 after marriage women are considered as consumable items like food cloth etc it means just as food cloth etc are required for the day to day life women will have to fulfill the sexual urge of each partner and perform day to day household works take care of family members after women after marriage women are women are considered as consumable goods it means just as food and cloth are day to day needs so women after marriage will have to perform day to day household works you will have to she will have to take care of family members and she will have to fulfill the sexual urge of his partner well sometimes girls are regarded as the marketable commodities it means at the time of negotiation of the marriage happy dowry is demanded otherwise marriage proposal is rejected another insult another problem for women is that women is considered as a marketable commodities because during a marriage negotiations happy dowry is demanded if happy dowry is not fulfilled the marriage proposal is cancelled so women is considered as a marketable commodity finally After marriage, women enjoy limited freedoms than before. Then, after marriage, a woman has a limited freedoms than before. So, I request my viewers to watch the whiteboard and to me so that they will be clear. I request my viewers to subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed, and tell of your friends about this channel so some students will be benefited. Any video you want, just write my name, Dilip Kumar Pal, and the name of the topic in YouTube. You will get both the audio and English video. Thank you. Have a very nice day.